two on. Same thing. New character. We are automatically the main seller. Yay! And now to the matter carriage where we're introduced to a new character. I thought she'll be able to finish this in single setting. Yay! Oh goodness! みのみより、あやかしの匂いを感じます。確かに匂うな。あやつはそこにおるのか。おそらくは下方に落ちた屋敷で下道に落ちた術師が一体何をしておるのやら。どう。愛も愉快な男よな。No They are basically our summons. I'm not kidding. Hold on. Let's go in here. So you have Heenan automatically. Like, look, she's like she starts out with all the great stuff. There's Zenki and I think Go Goki's here. There's Goki. Okay, let's change this up. Put that there, and then we have this: the ceremonial spear, holy spear of the dragon, king of five imp emperors. And then we have a bunch of we have healing cards. We have. Karyu cars, and then we have these two summons. A little tidbit, um, this character is called Abe no Sime. Abe no Sime was a real legendary person who actually existed in Japan during this time, who was considered to be the best seer in the world. Okay, whether or not you believe they were actually seer, they did in fact exist, except unlike you're seeing here, um, Abe no Sime was a man. Just so you know. And now we have the ice spell. But yeah. For this game they made Abe no Sime a woman. New summon. I have no idea why they did that. I must I don't really know. There's two possibilities. One is um, continuity that the other two characters were girls, so why not make the third character a girl too? The Second option, which I hope is not the reason, is that they didn't want to look sexist. Die. Hell yeah. But, like, the other option is that they didn't want to look sexist by having the strongest of the characters be a man as opposed to the other two girls. Which I hope is not the reason because that's just stupid. And there's her mantra, but in the game Abinosume is a girl. Or a woman. So we must find Domon and stop him from being a douche. Not that we're we're late on that, but <laughs> Trying to think of where we need to go. 
Okay, well, he's blocking our way. So. I'm pretty sure we don't have to do anything but head to the shrine. What does she have for items? Okay. The door's broken, so we can't go in there. Yeah, like I said, this one's pretty straightforward in that things are broken. Um, that place is blocked. And things are pretty much spelled out for us in this one. Because doors are either broken or they're permanently locked. Door won't, uh, doors won't open. Woo! Hibari cards. So I think pretty much everywhere is logged except the way to the shrine. Die! Get off! Hey! Didn't kill him. Why? This is ridiculous, Sime. There we go. Vessel. I'm pretty sure this one's completely straightforward in that it literally guides you through broken doors and stuff. You again. Die! Okay, they're dead. Her weapon is all badass and stuff. Alright, well this door was useless. There was nothing in here. Though I'm pretty sure there is something we have to find. It's um, one of the seals. That's broken. See, we can't even go that way. Go this way, but it's a dead end. See, I told you this place pretty much directs you exactly where to go. Now we're down here. Here comes some more. Hello. Look. There you are. Die! <laughs> Four strikes and dead. I like this stab. I love the spare! Best thing ever. Is there anything in here? Some cards. Lots of spell cards. Um, basically, the purpose of the Kuon phase is to complete the Utsuki Sakuya story, which, as you saw, w were pretty much the same story, but two sides of it. And they have the same end, which the Kuon phase continues after that, their ending. And also is the main fight. 
Okay, that was no biggie. Die! I have spear! Insta-death. I guess you're dead. So through here we go. And we find the tree. And a cutscene. I smell evil. This is the we need to find the spike. Don't want book volume two. I don't know if you read this. The mulberry trees harbor a powerful spell. They are living creatures with wills of their own. They live far longer than humans and are much more intelligent. After I've completed my mission and the time is right, I must subdue those twins once again. There are many ways to subdue them. Which way would be the best? Fire annihilates them immediately, but once they're dead, I won't be able to use them again. I suppose I'll suppress them by but keep them alive. I'll use a demon suppressing spike. But given their magical powers, one spike may not be enough. I must remember that the twins are a trivial concern. They're only tools for sorcery. In this realm, only that woman has the power to resist me. In case you haven't figured it out, he's talking about Seme. Let's save. Even though it, this thing isn't that long. Wait. Wait. Yeah, that'll work. We don't want to lose anything. We have no spikes. So we must find the spike. Do I have a map? Yeah. Ooh, is this unlocked over here? Nope. Okay. So we need to find a seal, the seal of Saturn, and we need to find- I'm pretty sure we need to find the seal of Saturn. There doesn't seem to be any ways that are blocked for us. But I don't think there's a point going that way. On the baby, I don't know. Nope, I can't go that way. It's blocked. It just didn't say so on the map. Kasime does not know about it. Whoop, is there something over here? Nope. Okay. So we continue onward to the small shrine, which should be open. I don't think we have to go... I'm pretty sure we don't have to go through the whole rigmarole again of finding the stuff. Oh, see that? See how she started to pant and you heard a heartbeat? That's what happens when you run too long. She started to get weak. So, had to heal her. To the shrine. Something over here? More Hibari cards. Don't really need to heal. Something is lying here. Two spikes. Okay, so I don't have them. I'm pretty sure they're easy to find because I just found two easy two spikes, like right off the bat. 